Well, you can probably gather that the orange crowd, the orange team, are probably getting pretty excited here right now. This is their moment. This is their time. The first Netherlands gold medal at the Paralympic Winter Games about to be presented. Please welcome the medalist for the women's snowboard cross standing. Приветствуем медалистов по сноуборд кроссу, женщины в классе стоя. Uh, here they come from the US, from France, and from the Netherlands. I think they're excited. It was the best of three runs, a combination of those two best performances. And Bibien Mentelschwe of the Netherlands won it by 9.88 seconds. And it was something very special for the 41-year-old. They, they won't mind me telling you that they're all in excess of 30 years old, all these athletes. Here's Rita van Driel of the Netherlands, IPC governing board member, together with Georgie Kobylanski of Russia. The medal will be presented by Ms. Rita van Driel, governing board member of the International Paralympic Committee, accompanied by Ms. Anna Drobina, deputy mayor of Sochi. Медали вручает госпожа Рита Вандриэль, член правления Международного Паралимпийского комитета, в сопровождении госпожи Анны Дробиной, заместителя главы города Сочи. Bronze medalist representing United States of America. Бронзовый призер, представительница Соединенных Штатов Америки, Эми Порди. Amy Purdy, 34, from Copper Mountain, originally from Las Vegas, steps on top of the podium and really does it in US style, doesn't she? She was second in the Paris snowboard cross standing in Osier. She's now got a bronze medal here and really has made a huge statement in her life. Never allow defeat to defeat you, she says. Well, she's certainly not allowed that. In 2012 season, she was part of the amazing race television show. Right after this, she's going to be dancing with the stars in the US as well. She is obviously a non-stop girl of action. Amy Purdy, bronze medalist. Silver medalist representing France. Серебряный призер, представительница Франции. It's a great name, I love it. 39 years old, Cecile Hernandez Epsevillon of France, from Perpignan in France. She's taken the silver medal in this first women's para snowboard cross standing championship. She has a daughter who will be looking at this and shouting at the television screen. Yep, it's a wonderful achievement. She has come through some extraordinary difficult things. She's written a book in 2008, La Guerre de Nerf, The War of Nerves. She's overcome them now, telling her supporters how much she appreciates them. Gold medalist and Paralympic champion representing Netherlands. Золотую медаль и звание чемпионки Паралимпийских игр. Завоевала представительница Нидерландов Бибиа Мэдэспе. This is the big one for the Netherlands. For the first time in their history, they pick up a Paralympian Winter Games gold medal. And this, this extraordinary lady, 41 years old, from Lustrecht, Bibia Mentelspe. You can see what it means also to Rita Van Driel as well. Something very special has happened here at Rosa Couture Alpine Resort tonight. She was chosen as the Netherlands flag bearer for the opening ceremony here in Sochi. They knew that they could rely on her to come with something special. Ladies and gentlemen, the anthem of Netherlands. 
Дамы и господа, звучит гимн Нидерландов. Ladies and gentlemen, the Paralympic medalists. Дамы и господа, победитель и призеры Паралимпийских игр. Vivian Medel Spey had already won the gold medal by the time they completed run two. Her combined score was better than any others in the competition. She then skied run three and improved on it even more. It was a sensational run, and she has absolutely inspired so many people, not only in the, the Netherlands, of course, but around the world. She set up the Mentality Foundation aims to encourage children with impairment to get involved in sport. She was actually the subject of a documentary called Vivia Mental, Mein Den van der Berg Olympus. Vivia Mental with one leg from Mount Olympus. It's a fantastic story of emotion and inspiration. Carpe Deum is her philosophy, and she certainly sees this the seventh day in Sochi. And the crowd of Dutch and Netherlands supporters have been so, so happy. And I tell you, the celebration's going to go on well into the night, here and in Utrecht and in Lustrecht, where she now resides. Champion, 